I'd like to point out that there are several different ways to get help with working inside ZBrush. The first and most convenient way is simply accessing the information built directly into the user interface. And this is simple to do. All you have to do is hover over an item you want to learn more about, for instance the brush pop-up, and I'll hold down the control key. As I do that, you can see that I get this nice paragraph of information that explains about this pop-up. Continuing to hold the control key, I'll move over other items in the user interface, and you'll see I'll get additional information about those items. Information is available not just for the items that you clearly see here on the UI, but inside palettes themselves. So for instance, I might go into the tool pop-up and move over one of the brushes in the 2.5D brush section, hold control, and I'll get information about these different brushes. So it's a really great way to explore ZBrush and figure out what each item does. Other areas that you can find help is on the web. Of course, inside zclassroom.com, where it's just where you can find all these videos. You can also go to zbrush.info to access the wiki and all the helpful information there. On our home page, you can simply click on the educational tab which will give you access to Z Classroom, the Wiki, third-party training, and other additional helpful tutorials, including the tutorial section inside ZBrush Central.